Top 10 Best NFT Play to Earn Games to Earn You know, there are a lot of ways to earn money in crypto, but the most interesting and enjoyable way is to earn by playing games. So, in today's video, we are going to explore 10 of the best NFT play to earn games through which you can earn hundreds of dollars on a daily basis. So, without any further delay, let's get into the video. So, let's start with the first game, which is Dino X. Dino X was founded by a group of tech-savvy individuals with a keen interest in blockchain technology, gaming, and cryptocurrency, as well as a strong interest in dinosaurs. For collectors and players, the team aims to create a complicated NFT gameplay experience. They're working on a game that combines popular genres for desktop and mobile devices. You'll find yourself surrounded by numerous packs of living dinosaurs on the islands of Dino X World. The catch and main concept are that they exist on the blockchain, allowing you to digitally own, care for, breed, train, and fight various creatures that inhabit the islands. The game is simple to learn, but it has a more complicated game design to accommodate varied player skill levels. When the MVP is launched in the coming weeks, 8,000 Dino Eggs will be accessible to be farmed using the staking features. Then, the second one is Crypto vs. Zombie. This is the ultimate competitive tower defense gaming ecosystem for PvP and C2E. Their goal is to become the most well-known crypto tower defense brand in the GameFi industry. The user's goal is to play more and earn more. They've designed their game to be both offensive and defensive, with gamers fighting in epic battles with crypto defense towers and zombie armies in a one-of-a-kind gaming experience. Winners of their seasonal competition will receive tokens and NFT incentives. They want to give all players the chance to enjoy the game and earn money at any time and from anywhere using only their mobile devices. Then on our third number comes Black Eye Galaxy. Black Eye Galaxy, or BYG, describes itself as a virtual metaverse platform that allows users to create, enjoy, and monetize content and applications using the Ethereum and Binance blockchains. Users can buy planets and solar systems, search the galaxy for new planets, mine and sell planet resources, build a society on an occupant planet, and sell land as NFTs in this virtual universe. All mined planet resources and planets discovered by you could be sold in BYG tokens, allowing you to profit from your participation in the project. It somehow falls more in the metaverse category, but still, it's a type of game where you can build your property and then further sell it. Moving on to our number four, which is Wanaka Farm. Wanaka Farm is a Binance Smart Chain virtual agricultural game in which users can develop fields, tend crops, breed pets, and beautify their virtual estate. Players will be able to buy or rent land and harvest crops to sell for Wana later on. Seasons, land levels, and product and animal species will all be included in the game. NFTs will be used to design certain in-game elements. Wanaka Farm aspires for a play-and-earn approach rather than a play-to-earn model in which players cooperate and create a calm atmosphere in the game rather than compete with one another. Wanaka Farm hopes to attract young women and men from Southeast Asia and South America who are looking for a collaborative game with earning potential by giving an immersive experience that will only grow with the advancement of AR and VR technology. Wanaka Farms expects to release an upgraded smartphone version in the first quarter of 2022, with an AR version following in the second quarter. In the second half of 2022, the VR version and cross-chain NFT compatibility are expected. Let me first say that it's great that you're still watching, which must mean you like what you're seeing. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and win $100 in cryptos. Just a quick reminder, our channel has a weekly giveaway of $100 worth of a cryptocurrency of your choice. All you have to do to win is, watch this video, drop us a comment below this video saying you subscribed, and let us know which cryptocurrency you would choose and why. The winners will be contacted directly. Good luck! Now, on the number 5 comes Ultimate GG. Spend your Alt-GG on the Ultimo-GG platform and their partners after you've been rewarded for everything you've done on the platform, from winning tournaments to creating content and participating in the community. With Ultimo-GG, you may buy NFTs or make your own to commemorate your favorite gaming memories, or convert Alt-GG to Fiat to make your goal of working in the gaming industry a reality. Aren't these games interesting? I think they are. What do you guys say? 
So now, let's move towards other games. Moving on to our number sixth game, which is Aliens World. Alien Worlds is a multi-planet NFT metaverse with seven worlds. The purpose of the game is to gain Trillium, or TLM, an in-game cryptocurrency that can be traded for real money. To compete for a part of the TLM reward pool, players can harvest TLM or dispatch virtual spaceships on missions across the metaverse. After completing a mission, each traveler can get up to five NFTs. In addition to exploring the various planets, the game allows players to compete against one another on the BSC blockchain. We'll now move on to our next game, Illuvium. Illuvium is a blockchain-based RPG set in an open environment. Players must defeat and catch alluvials as they wander through a magical environment. Alluvials can be utilized in battle against other players once you've collected them while questing, completing challenges, or progressing through Illuvium's plot. The Illuvium project revolves around collecting and customizing NFT alluvials. Affinity and class are assigned to each alluvial. There are five classes and five affinities, each with its own set of advantages and disadvantages. As you win battles and complete tasks, your alluvial grows stronger. An NFT marketplace can be used to exchange all of Illuvium's in-game assets, including alluvials and objects. If you want to earn ILV and SILV, Illuvium's in-game currency, you can buy the token on Binance and start staking on Illuvium's platform. Or, you can stake partner tokens in exchange for ILV. Then, there's Mobox, the eighth game on our list. Mobox is a cross-platform GameFi metaverse that blends DeFi yield farming with gaming NFTs. Mobox NFTs, commonly known as Momos, can be obtained through Binance NFT Mystery Box launches or the Binance NFT secondary market. Momo NFTs can be used to farm, battle, and create crypto rewards. Within the Mobox metaverse, participants can also exchange their Momos, stake them to cultivate Mbox tokens, or use them as collateral. Mobox offers simple gameplay that incorporates both free-to-play and play-to-earn elements. The game emphasizes NFT interoperability, allowing players to use their Mobox assets in multiple games at the same time. Now it's time to move on to our second-last game, which is My Neighbor Alice. My Neighbor Alice is a multiplayer world-building game that combines the best of both worlds, a fun experience for casual players and a trading and collecting environment for NFTs. In the form of an NFT token, players purchase and possess virtual parcels of land from Alice or the marketplace. Because there is a limited supply of available land, market prices fluctuate. If you're a good landowner, the in-game reputation system will grant you additional perks. In addition to land, players can purchase and use in-game assets for their avatars, such as houses, animals, vegetables, decorations, and cosmetic items. The Alice token, which can also be purchased on Binance, is the game's principal currency. Alice tokens are used for in-game transactions, such as land purchases, as well as DeFi services, such as staking, collateralization, and buyback. And it's now finally time to reveal the last game, which is Mines of Dalarnia. Mines of Dalarnia is a unique blockchain-powered real estate market in an action-adventure gaming concept. Miners and landowners, two cooperative groups, make up the player base. Landowners give the land and resources, while miners battle monsters and destroy blocks in search of valuable resources. Players can also work together with their friends to kill monsters, accomplish tasks, and get access to in-game rewards. The in-game assets for Mines of Dalarnia are available for purchase on the Binance NFT marketplace from Q1 2022 as part of their planned IGO collection. Upgrades, skill progression, governance, transaction fees, and other in-game transactions are all done with DAR, the in-game money. So, that's the end of the video for today with all 10 best and most interesting NFT play-to-earn games. Playing these games can let you have a passive income, but for that, you will have to be a pro, which you can become if you play regularly. Watch the video I post on the screen next. It will help you massively in understanding how to be successful in NFTs. I will explain to you in depth what exactly NFTs are, how they work, and how they are related to the gaming world. If you want to learn everything there is to know about NFTs, then I will see you in the next video.